Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the first Let's Play on the brand new channel, Adam Squared. Woo! With oh, me, Adam, and this guy, who's Adam. also called Adam. We're doing Show Night Co-op because we thought, what better way to start off than with a co-op platformer? It only helps that this is now the third time we're attempting this. Yeah, we've had some many recording issues and and such. At least, ugh, this is the third time we're trying to do this. Yeah. I don't even care about the name anymore. Geth Poop. Geth Poop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Get so funny, boys. Whoa. Add that fucking yeah. amiibo in. So for the co-op, we need an amiibo. And we're not going to break the game yet. And use Custom Knight, because that really is overpowered. Yeah. You get... I've played around with the amiibo knight more than the genuine game. Uh, you can beat levels in under five minutes, as in the much longer levels, with Jesus. the amiibo knight. That's, that's awesome. Oh, yeah, this game is a story. <laughs> Long ago, the lands were untamed and dreamed by legendary adventurers. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shovel Knight. It sounds like uh, the guy who plays Gandalf. What's his name? Ian, Ian McKellen. McKellen. Yeah. But the travels together ended at the Tower of Fate. Alright, now it doesn't. doesn't. <laughs> when a cursed amulet was a terrible magic. I'm guessing we have to go to the Tower of Fate at some point. Whoa! When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed and Shovel Knight was gone. Aww. His spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight was about to bury himself alive. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I mean, went into a life of solitude. One of the lives of solitude. But without champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the Enchantress and an order of no quarter. I wonder if people are gonna understand you. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's just text. <laughs> now, the tower was unsealed. And devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Yes. With this guy and his shovel. Wait, no. Why? Okay, oh, why? Oh, why? Is my chromosome structure. But. Oh. <laughs> oh, wow. That's hilarious. Why did Shovel Knight pick a fucking shovel as his weapon? Maybe he got mixed up. Like, went to the gardening center instead of, like, the, <laughs> the weaponry. Armory. Maybe he's, like, had to go to spec... Should have gone to spec savers, right? Should have gone to fucking... Why... Why are we referencing spec savers? This Fucking is... move, I want the money. That's like one pound, dude. Or dollar if you're American. Dollar. Whoa, dude, I'm totally juggling that. Did you, you can see? Juggle it. Oh, yeah, forget. Can you boost? Hold on. Yep, we can boost in co-op. All right. Well, that's dope. Shovel Knight is very clearly a platformer that borrows very heavily from the likes of Castlevania, Mega Man, and DuckTales, that one game I never played, but I've heard it's decent. It's got a PS4 remaster, so there's no reason we can't let's play at some point. Actually, I can't want to do that sooner than later. That sounds like a fun game. We don't need the checkpoint. Sure, we ready? don't need it, but I'm getting it anyway, because... Fair enough. We could fuck up pretty badly, knowing us. Yeah, and we probably will. Like, every time we've tried this, we've died to the first boss. Every time. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's also mini-bosses, which we could technically skip, so... Don't skip it! I you like it. You have 30 him. seconds to beat him before I skip it. Ah! Got, got him. Alright, lit. You're just trying to steal my health, dude. Yep. Wait, we haven't lost anything, so no, it's fine. No, we haven't. Oh, no, I have. Thanks so, for jinxing it, dickhead. The mechanics of Shovel Knight basically include... A shovel. A shovel. <laughs> That's pretty much it. And the pogo mechanic from DuckTales. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> I think that's what... I think... It's definitely called DuckTales, right? I don't know why, yeah. but there's a different name I'm thinking of. To be honest, I haven't played it. Maybe I we haven't. could uh, play it on the channel. Good. Yeah. I don't know if we should do the original or the remastered. I I wouldn't know. Probably remastered. I don't know. I need to find out what's more preferable. Cause I know some remastered ports just aren't worth playing, like TMNT Turtles in Time. Apparently that got a miserable remaster. What are we gonna do? Beat em ups anyway. Beat em ups. Yeah, like Tur you know what? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, fun. Streets of Rage. It's always fun to mash buttons. Mega Man the Power Fighters apparently. <laughs> Who the fuck has played Mega Man the Power Fighters? You, probably? No, I genuinely haven't. Bing. I only found out about it the other day when I was looking up games we could play. And it genuinely looks like a beat-em-up, but Mega Man. I know, I'd have to look into it. Scattered throughout all of these levels are basically just money. Like, you yeah. can tell when there's a wall, but some of them are really, like, hidden. Yeah, usually there's, like, cracks in the wall or little faces. In, like, King Knight's level, it's little faces, I'm yeah, pretty sure. Yeah, it is, sure. isn't it? I can't remember much else, but... Because I don't think I've played, like, past King Knight in a while. <laughs> nope, since that's as far as we got 
before we had to restart <laughs> yeah. twice. So we, you, you're looking at us playing this level for about the third time. And you're probably thinking, wow, these guys are blazing through it just fine. EA yeah, must be speedrunning pros. No, nope, nope. we've just played this we, game a shit ton. We just, we just... Well, I mean, good job on that jump. We, we must be speedrunning pros. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> uh, I wonder what the world record is. I might look that up after this part. Yeah, that'd be cool. Like... Either way, it, I would probably do this faster than it would take me to get bored of Ghostbusters. The 2016 movie. I love that movie. Shut the fuck up. No, you don't. Okay, no, I don't. We watched it the other day, and it oh, God. was so it was dog shit. <laughs> so when I like, went to straight Adam's up dog to shit, watch it, uh, he said to me like, "How bad is it?" And I was like, "There is not a single scene of this movie I enjoy." And he's like, "Really? Yeah, really. I wasn't fucking joking. That movie is absolute shit." Yeah, there was a little bit of forewarning that you gave me, and I was like, "You know, why did you do <laughs> scary, dude? Stop." <laughs> that that movie was so. Every every character was trying way too hard. Except Chris Hemsworth as Kevin. It, except Chris Chris Hemsworth, yeah. Like, that was entertaining. He was he was so dumbly written that he was like the only one I liked because he wasn't trying too hard. <laughs> Everyone else, especially Leslie Jones's Patty, I think her name was. I oh, know I've already forgotten all the characters' names. They're that they're not that uninteresting. Not to mention, I really don't. I still don't know the answer to this. You know how when they make DVD releases, they put borders around them? Well, Ghostbusters has that, but whether it's an editing error or free Like a widescreen border? Yeah. Oh, you mean the effects? Yeah. But whether it's oh. an editing error or just when they try to do 3D, you, the beam goes outside the border, and I, I don't know why. I think it was actually an editing error, because there were points where, there were like, points some where ghost you faces. Would, yeah. There are points where you'd think it would be 3D, but no, so I'm convinced it's an editing error. It was, anyway, I'll it put was like so a, goddamn tacky. I'll put a screenshot up about here and you can see what we mean. But if someone could clarify that, that would be great. Yeah, if you see the a border on the screen, the little black border where... Oh, dude, you just killed like three of them in a go. I know, right? Not to mention that movie is full of mistakes. Like, uh, Adam, I don't, if anyone else has seen this, there's a dude, scene Dude, we haven't where, lost any health. No, there isn't. Oh, no, no, crap. That's pretty lit. You can tell how many times we've done this. Usually we're like half-life at this point. Yeah. Probably because you've died. I show your face sooner or later, a cerulean coward. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing for Shall you Shall I do the voice for Shovel Knight? Yeah, go for it. Stand aside, Black Knight. I have no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate. Your time away has dulled your senses, can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress. And her invincible knights of the Order of No Quarter stand between you and the tower. But none of that matters, because anyone after the Enchantress has to go through me. Ooh, big man. Steal thy shovel. Well, let's go. First boss. <laughs> Alright, you can you can take this. Have fun. Why do you You say that every time and it goes miserably? It like usually it is goes now. fine. Do something, you clod. Okay, I'll do something. Ah! Oh. Look what you did. Okay, but that's not the point here. But getting back to Ghostbusters, because I'm not. Yeah, actually, I'm not letting the only this run thing into I can think two. of right now. Uh, I forgot where I was going. Damn it! What was I? Saying? Yeah, there is also a ton of like, fuck. Don't don't come back in. Too Trust late. Me. There is a ton of movie errors. Like, you know the scene where generic fat girl is using the polter beam, whatever it's called. Wait, if he shoots something, and she something, starts wait. flying around. She starts flying around in the scene. Yeah. If you look carefully, uh. Between the shots, like she somehow switches hands on when she's holding the gun. Okay, that it's is a really minor off continuity error no. compared to some of the shit that's in that film. Okay, true, but it's so fucking off-putting. I just, I just, I love the pacing of it. You know how like the first fifty minutes was spent, like doing nothing, doing practically nothing, and finding the first weapon, and then like ten minutes later, they've got like a whole arsenal of different fucking proton <laughs> grenades and shit, and lit. Everything just pops the fuck off all at once. It's yeah. ridiculous. <laughs> oh wait, we got dream sequence. Yeah, this is where we pretend we we yeah pretend that we have someone. Catch to... the bitch. Go off. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Dang it. We've ever the same idea <laughs> of using each other. That happens like every video game we play. You know what? I'm good actually. I'll just lay here. Oh, let me see who won. The answer is it's probably me. Probably yeah. Can't end this part without knowing that I'm better than you. Ah. Oh. Hey, Lamau. Yeah, usually it's... 
Okay, well, baby steps. <laughs> baby steps. Hey, what the so hell? Wing. How did you get so much money? I guess I'm just better than you at Shovel Knight. Aw. You know what? If there was a crown in this, like there is in uh, Mario 3D World, this would go horribly wrong. This would be wrong. really salty and competitive. Yep. And with that, we'll see you next time at Adam Squared. Yeah. <laughs>